are going to be improving this Galaxy S8 Plus. Thanks to this, I fix it. Protect. I fix it. Protect. Okay. Got it. Okay, so I scared myself because the little flex sensor just popped off, um, but it looks like the connector came with it, so. So here's the other catch, is I think I have to remove this from the back case because these cases don't come with that. All right, so my challenge for when I reassemble this case is that I don't know how to put these back on because I don't have adhesive for them. So maybe that's something I have to get. All right, so that took just under half an hour um, to remove the back, and that was my first time. So if I was normal, now all I would have to do is <laughs> stick the new back back on, but I'm not normal, so I fix it has helped as much as they can, and I fix it. We will see you on the other side of this crazy adventure. Now I have a, a back that I'm like not afraid to kind of screw up, so that's exciting. Okay, so the dude at the store said that um, if you heated this up, he could peel the paint off? Peel? You could get it off. So we're gonna heat it up and see how it goes. What I learned is that there is a correct temperature and that if it is too hot, it leaves a goopy residue, and if it is too cool, you can't pull it off. Okay, so now that I've got this clear back, I'm realizing that when I dip it, when I water marble it, I need this um, glass, like the, the, the surface, to be perfectly covered, and because this melted a little bit, I'm gonna remove it and masking tape. All right, so now I have my perfectly masking taped off thing, but I need a little handle. Okay. So now I can, Oop. here's my water marbling box. Um, it will get covered in nail polish, that's okay. But first, let's pick out the colors.
<laughs> I'm gonna take uh, like this gold and try to splatter paint it first, just a little bit, um, and then and then marble it. So it's like a galaxy. All right, so I need black, and I have this nice sparkly black too. Okay, so black, and then where are the two colors? I just pulled out. Oh, purple, of course. Galaxy must. Not sponsored plug. Um, the OPI top coat over any nail polish makes it last in the shop. The more you know. Okay, so my ner my nervousness is that nail polish is too thick to splatter paint. And I'm sort of right. We're gonna just go for it. Alright, so I haven't done this whole water marbling thing in years. Literally like maybe a decade. And I've never done it with this many colors and in such a big area. So I have my concerns. We can always nail polish strip it, nail polish remover strip it, and start over, so. So now I'm just gonna, and there she is. So now I just have to let that dry. What I am gonna do is hit it with heat gun really quick to get the bubbles out. Confidence level's not high. Not very high at all. I don't know. It's nine o'clock. We're gonna go home and pick this up again tomorrow. It's so early in the morning. And now that I have coffee, we're back to arts and crafts with Zyla. Shoot, I need to wear my eye. Fix it, sure. Okay, take three. I'm gonna. What are you following me? What? I'm about to take my shirt off. You can't, you can't leave that. <laughs> okay, so this is what it looks like right now. I think it looks cooler from the other side for no reason except the fact that I want to, so I'm telling myself that. Um, but as you can see, I can see the blue masking tape through it a lot, which means that it's still mostly clear, just with these like swirls of color. This looks like third grader art. Ah. Okay, I'm just gonna do a couple splotches of color, and then I'm gonna take this, put it on this brush, and just whoosh, the whole thing. That's where my sanity is. Okay, we'll let it dry. And it's dry. Look at that, that's not easy. I'm just gonna take what appears to be my most opaque black, you don't want to just like spray paint it with And that would be a smarter, but that's not what I'm doing, so. Take my brush. Ah, who? I forgot the thing where nail polish pulls up other nail polish. I might have ruined it. Mm, screw this. Let's spray paint it black. <laughs> just gonna spray paint it black. Ah, ah. Now we have this. Um, there's some seriously high lumps. That's a little bit worrying. I might have to sand that down. Maybe I'll just take a tiny, tiny bit of sandpaper just to this little edge right here um, and take a little of the height off. Bad idea. Abort mission. Abort mission! All right, so I think that this case has got to be considered done. There's like no other abuse I can put it through. All right, so the big moment. I'm really excited. I'm gonna... Oh my god, wait. Do you see this? Oh my god, my projects never go to plan. This is beautiful. Oh my god, it is. All the different textures and glitter patterns that of the nail polish came through beautifully. Like, and I think like what did this is the fact that it's the inside because it looked so bad from the outside. And it's never gonna get damaged because it's going right on the inside of the phone. Oh, you know what we did forget though? What? The um, flash. Okay, um, <laughs> I was a little bit dumb. This is something you can avoid, but it turns out that the clear part, the cutout for the flash is a cutout in the paint and not in the case. So now this one has no flash. Kind of pretty. Did not think about it at all. It's like a cheaper way to do a resin pour that is completely, well, it had some amount of thickness, but not nearly the amount of thickness that a resin pour would have. Um, but it's a lot more detailed. I really am glad that I, at the end, I went in with those extra colors. I'm sad it's not on my real phone. Yeah, I'm like 
Sad that we did this on an S8 Plus and I have an S9, so. Do it to my real phone. No, then I would kill the warranty. Yeah, so I'm definitely way less stressed about breaking my phone now. And also, I think I see breaking my phone as an opportunity to do something like this to it, because these are really cool and flashy. And like, the amount of time we spend with our phone attached to us, it may as well look as awesome as this. Okay, so um, I want to emphasize how easy this was. This one I bought nothing for. It was all nail polish I had in my house. The kit I Fix It sent us here is the $70 Protect Toolkit, um, but the only tools that I used for it was the heat, was my own heat source, which could be a hair dryer, um, these spudgers, which were really useful, like the guitar pick kind of things, and the suction cut. And I used some of the scrapers and things, especially to get the paint off. We'll link directly to the things that we used specifically to, to make this, um, but also we're gonna be doing a giveaway of the Protect Toolkit, so you can have it all. To enter the giveaway, all you've gotta do is hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and leave your favorite space joke down in the comments below. If you literally get me to laugh out loud, I'll toss in an extra entry. For additional entries, go like at Beauty and the Bolt and at iFixit on Instagram and comment a joke on that post as well.